I'm homeless. I used to be a lifeguard for 30 years. And I was a Navy SEAL before that time. I swam 12 miles every day. Once a day in 1978, I was off the coast of Catalina. And I saw bubbles coming up from the water. And I could see the mass of a man 84 feet below a diving bell. It was a Russian diplomat. It was covered by the newspapers. I saved that man. Yes. I have life-saving skills. Yes, lifeguard Bob is a person. I'm not a statistic. And so I dived into the deep water to save this man. <coughs> and so at 70 feet, it was time to decompress. It was time to decompress. So I had to, let's go with some of the CO2. turns out that I wasn't actually being too hard for them. One day, uh, later on, after the relationship had terminated between me and their mom, I'm at a bus stop in Santa Monica, and the bus pulls up, and no sooner had I put one foot in the stairwell, I heard somebody say, She welcomed me on the bus. I don't know if I paid or not, but <laughs> I got on the bus, and when we got to the layover, she pulled out her cell phone. And she called her family Paula, and I got, I got to reconnect with them. And Paula said that she would always remember me for pushing her toward education. They all finished college, two have master's degrees, one have a community college degree. And I didn't feel, I, I, at that point, I didn't feel so bad that I was so hard on because I was really, really on the line at home. Well, you know, so, Mr. Tony is here, the homeless social service advocate. Oh. Thank you, Mr. Our proposal was to have the bus tickets passed out at Step on Second and at OPCC so that their most vulnerable clients would be guaranteed beds. We're talking about the elderly, the handicapped, and women. These people, those people who really need it, okay? But unfortunately, the county refused to compromise with us, so our exactly. hands are tied. So how do you plan to get the most vulnerable people to the pickup sites that are outside of Santa Monica? Are you giving out bus tokens or bus passes or something? No, I understand what you're doing here, okay? We are trying the best. The problem that we have here is there are only 300 beds at the two west side shelters, and there there's over 7,000 homeless people in the city of Santa Monica. What we're trying to do by pass on the tickets also is to prevent people from coming from all parts of the county to Santa Monica to line up for the bus. So how many people are going to die on the sidewalk of despair before they get help? Is that a neighborhood? They can go elsewhere. <laughs> Listen, I know, I understand, okay? I know what you people are going to do. Oh! 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 Oh
joke with her, maybe use some humor, and tell her, you know, you don't really look that good. us. We joined hands and danced barefoot amongst the rubble. We were cleansed, liberated. We would never don the old armors again. One, two, One, three, three, 